And we're back. Oh, I regret that already. <laughs> Pointing at the camera and you shit. Need to, you need to do a compilation of you saying the beginning of every episode, I think. Why? Are they all like that? Yeah, they're, yeah. they're pretty similar to that. You'll, no. <laughs> oh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> do something. And usually I'll interrupt you and you'll yell at me for it. But, uh, what do you mean? I love them, though. I, I never yell. You, no, they no. last like I think a couple episodes ago I was talking in the middle and you kind of like looked like like, like hey I'm, do, I'm doing parent, I'm like doing I'm the intro here. here. Yeah. All right, well welcome back to Huge Man. <laughs> yeah, thanks for having us. Yeah. Another week, great another episode. Another, we're all here. Yeah, my great Paul. week. <laughs> it's Valentine's Day. <laughs> it yeah. is Valentine's Day. Happy Valentine's, everybody. I hope you're fucking a lot. Happy yeah. Valentine's Day. I Paul. hope you're just getting into that. We what do you guys? What do you guys have planned for? Your significant others. Probably a nice dinner, personally. I don't know about you, Jack. Um, if I'm not working, probably a dinner. Oh, it's on a, wait, so it's on a Sunday? Probably going to Melting Pot. No, it's pot. on Tuesday. Oh. Tuesday after the show. Melting Pot. pot. Ooh. Yeah. Ooh. We love Melting Pot. I haven't been there in a long time. It's yeah, great. I didn't know those were still around. Yeah, dude. There, the one there's only the Red one Bank. in Red Bank. Yeah. It's great, though. Mm. Good drinks. Very expensive. It's just get dip, You just dip stuff in cheese and chocolate. Sure do. And hot oil. You can put it's crazy that it's so expensive though, and you're cooking all the food. It yeah, it is fucked up. Like you're, they don't do anything. They just you know. Nah, they kind of like fuck around a little bit. Like they'll like come over and like start the like, mix light process, some, light some stuff on fire, and yeah, they tell you about like give where a, little, a cheese a was show. aged and how long. I don't know. Definitely. It's worth nice. it though. I get suckered in every time. Yeah, it's like a bocce. You just like, you know what you're in for, but it's just still like, no way. What are they gonna do without onion? <laughs> Holy shit! Look at that thing. <laughs> So it's nice, I don't know. Yeah. Yeah. That's what we're gonna probably do. Yeah, I have no plans. Should be yet. good. So you don't know if you're working or not? No, I'm definitely gonna be working, but I don't know if I'll have time to just go to dinner real quick or not. Mm. Mm. Yeah. Mm. Well, Hopefully. I don't have any plans. So you, all you single ladies out there. Yeah. Oh you, yeah. Like all you subscribe. single yeah. female huge manhood fans. I know. Like we have know time. there's a lot of you. A lot of field hockey players out there love <laughs> yeah. us. I can't believe we didn't get like any hate on that. Uh, yeah, there kind sure of, no, I know in some comments I saw there was no hate, but a lot of like, there's someone would comment like, uh, former field hockey player here, and like they would just like tear the video into uh, also. So. They make fun of us. No, they didn't really say anything. How no one said make, anything. How can they about... make fun of us? Yeah. No. Did they see the clip? <laughs> That's true. That's a sport they're dying on a hill for. Yeah. Mm. But uh, if the chick. This might be too soon with the Bills player. If the goalie had a heart attack and just dropped, she would have made the save. Yeah. <laughs> if she would have done anything else besides what she did, she would have saved the ball. It's, all right, we're referencing back a clip that will be from now three weeks ago. But anyway, It's our most sure. famous clip, so. Yeah, I'm yeah sure we're really happy it. about it. It's, yeah. Honestly, today we put right. it out, and it's like getting so many views. It's our golden yeah. egg. We're kind of famous now. Yeah. I yeah. love it. Yeah, all right. You guys uh, ever get your nipples sucked? Um, No, I don't think so. I have, like, Kind of hairy nipples, so I don't think. Mm, that I mean, I mine aren't shaved either. I don't know if I've ever. Probably not. <laughs> oh, when you say it like that, I kind of want to suck your nipple now, Paul. <laughs> Have you ever sucked your own nipple, Paul? Uh, no. Not, I couldn't do that if I wanted to. I probably could. I probably will now. I probably could. They're that nice, huh? But yeah, it's actually it's pretty. Paul wild. has very suckable nipples, it's ladies. Pretty wild. So. If anyone has some whipped nice. cream. Nice. So did that happen recently? Or? <laughs> <laughs> within the year. Within the year. Nice. I was like, whoa. It's a crazy feeling. Yeah. Yeah. Sometimes you got to, whether it's a job interview or the bedroom, you got to go into it. No, listen. You got to go into it and try to make yourself stand out. And clearly that, you know, person stood out to you. And maybe it's a good yeah. move. <laughs> I'm just saying, you don't want to go in and just be the same old, you know, you don't want to say the same thing. I'm going to work hard. I'm going to bang you missionary. I'm going to do this, that, the other. You got to go in there. You got to suck a nipple. Holy shit. You're you sucking suck my a nipple, nipple every like, now and then. Yeah. To, like, what is this? This is new to me. And now it's memorable. You'll never forget that person. Which nipple was it? Left. 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 Yeah. Right, over, right over your heart. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> do you guys, Did you return the favor? I mean, I'm sure she's probably returning the favor. I suck a mean tit. <laughs> Atta boy. <laughs> you, you, look, you look like you suck a mean tit. Oh, really? Yeah. What gives it away? The glasses. Yeah, I was just, do you wear your contacts usually like on dates or do you wear glasses? No, I haven't. I almost never wear my contacts now. They're so will you the take ass. the like, will you like 
time to go to work, take them off. Usually, then... <laughs> <laughs> it's usually at a certain point they'll take them off for me. And oh, I'm like, oh, damn, good. So you got good that thought. Thing. Yeah. You got that. Yeah. Yeah. What is it? Do you tell them to be How careful about the with scene them? in Scary Movie Two when the girl takes off the guys, the guy with the uh, in the wheelchair, the scary in Scary yeah. Movie Two, the guy in the wheelchair. She takes off his glasses, try to seduce him, and he's got the fucking like eyes rolling. <laughs> yeah. around, and she's like, "I'll let you put those back on." Yeah. <laughs> Yeah, it's kind of uh, like that. Yeah, that's what happens. So your eyes roll around. They're like, "Damn, that's hot." Let me get that nipple. Yeah, nice. exactly. Not bad, dude. Hell yeah. You guys got a thing that you're willing to talk about? I don't really have any. No. Oh, everybody's got some. I don't know, man. I got to be honest. My parents with you. watch this podcast. I can't. <laughs> I can't go into that. Yeah. Are you kidding me? No, my is parents actually watch it. Is that no, going to no. be a problem going forward? We're not going to be able no. to talk about stuff because your parents no. watch. No. no, definitely not. Well, I really don't think. Why I are you guys just stop? Stop this part. Stop huh? for it. Why don't they just? Oh, fine. Okay. Oh, you mean, it's Valentine's yeah. episode. Wanted to make it funny, but Paul really wants to know our sexual adventures. <laughs> yeah, well, I just told you one of mine. Yo, I'm not married yet, so I don't really fool around with that stuff. Nibble sucking? Anything? No, you, oh, you don't have sex. Good yeah. Catholic. Mike's a good yeah, Catholic. Yeah, that's it. He's saving himself. Yeah. Hmm. Mm-hmm. All right. Well, you guys are boring. Yeah. So speaking about, I know that we were just in the in the love. You were talking about love and, and of course, nipple sucking, but it is the, <laughs> they the go dead together. of winter. They're hand about, in hand. I don't know about you guys. It Your nipples get been, hard? No, no. Well, <laughs> yes, for a different reason. It has been so cold and shitty and dark in Jersey. I don't know about you guys. I just feel like I'm like right in the midst of like, we just had the holidays. January is a pretty boring month. It's long. Like I am in the middle of just starting to lose my mind and like not necessarily well, seasonal you know depression. You know you're saying this, right? No, you have no why? idea why I'm saying this. Because you haven't had a drink all month. Oh, that's true. <laughs> drink all how's that going? What's the, how's the sober? It's good. No, it's been fine. It's so close to the end now, too, that it really wasn't that bad. And, you know, it's a good way to start so, the year. Sounds like you're having a pretty hard time what you well, just told me. I mean, I am. And I'll tell you, like, why it, like, really clicked to me today. And I had to, like, take a step back and look at myself. I, I don't know if this is, again, like, seasonal depression or just, like, angst of it just being cold and nothing to do. I have been recently just, like cursing and freaking out on like random basic things happening <laughs> kids so i was just kids. like putting get off my i was, I was getting Piece this sweatshirt shit. today to to come to, to put on for the show and another sweatshirt just like happened to fall off a different shelf and i just screamed at it for some reason i don't know why what'd you say i was like you fucking scumbag are you kidding me <laughs> to a like, you fucking scumbag get to back a, on the shelf to a sweatshirt yeah and it, yeah it's it's happened a couple times we're like i don't know i'll like have random outbursts i don't know if it's a me problem or if it's I think yeah, it sounds like, to lose sounds like you mind. need a drink or a beer or something that would yeah that actually i didn't think about that which is stupid so tomorrow it's you're gonna drink tomorrow right Cause tomorrow's louis ck right Tomorrow is yeah. Yeah, you're gonna drink, right? I don't know. I'm still like I'm I'm so close no, too. Last time we I talked, probably you no, were. I was going to, but then I've gotten this far and it's kinda like you I think know, I, I think I might Madison pay, Square Garden. Yeah. I think I might pay for that stream. Yeah, it's probably gonna be great. Well, I know it's gonna be great. Where do you where do you pick that up? <clears throat> His he website. Po- yeah, he oh. posted something that you can get the stream for twenty five bucks, Paul? Or twenty bucks? Something like that. Yeah. So go to LouisCK.com, blah 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 blah. Stop yeah. talking about that. Yeah. yeah we're not. Um anyway. Yeah, yeah. So I'm not sure if I'm going to drink for. I was planning on it, but again, now I'm so close to the I mean, end of dry January. It's going to be thinking, like, why not? It's going to be expensive beer if you do drink. Well, also I have to take the fucking train there and doing that sober. I hate, I hate the train. <clears throat> I feel like I'm my blackout. My sure. ice and my drink. I'm sh- rattling right next to my mic. It's probably super annoying. No, yeah, probably the, the huge man. It's all about sipping. And at least you two are doing it. This is AMSR or whatever the hell oh. that is. ASMR? Oh my God, I hate that shit. <laughs> it's so stupid. Dude, yeah, I had a I had a friend in like the city who was like, he like liked that. That's how I found out about it. And I, he showed it to me. And I was like, not friends anymore? This is the weirdest fucking and thing it's, I've ever It's seen. one thing which is still weird, but like in, when girls are saying or guys, whoever like they're trying to, you know, their target audience, if they're like saying anything, especially sexually in that like voice, I've seen them where they're just like tapping on the microphone. Yeah, I don't get that. Like, why do you? What do you want to hear that sound for? I don't understand. A lot. Some people just watch videos of people eating. I That's like bizarre. That. Just like listening to. That's on our channel. Never, I have heard about that. That's weird. <laughs> <laughs> That's on our channel. Put like AMSR, and it'll just be like full blown. I was like, farting into the mics. <laughs> yes. I was gonna say diarrhea farts, but yeah, yeah. it's all yeah. same. Yeah, or just like I don't know. The episode that I do the beer tower, should we fully like ASMR the whole thing? I just won't talk the whole episode. I'll just you chug chugging. every beer like with the microphone in the beer. Yeah, <laughs> <laughs> just whisper. Yeah, and then you have it next to the, the next to the spout as you open it up into the yeah. glass. Every beer, I'll like 
Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, so, so if we don't make it here, we're gonna become SMR, AMSMR, AMSR. Well, Dude, well, why don't we just broaden our horizon? We'll do it anyway. We'll just do it. Multifaceted, everything. yeah. Yep. So, right. Yeah. Add it to the list of things we're gonna do. AMSR competition. We've delivered one thing so far that we. We are, yeah, we are what the kings. We the book report. Yeah, I think that's... we are the kings of promising like what we're gonna do in the next episode. <laughs> yeah. The next episode comes, and it's like, what you guys get up to? Someone can go through and make a list of the things we promised you guys. I promise I'm doing. Yeah, the someone. Tower. Let's let you guys. Someone go through our episodes and let us know what we owe you. We got to get we'll a get person who just I guess a basketball is, game. Yeah, really, yeah, really, someone. If someone could just help me out, us out in any <laughs> way. <laughs> Is this a cry for help? <laughs> <laughs> like literally do anything it would be so helpful. Our cash app is in the bio. Yeah. <laughs> I'm not like in, when, when, intern you know, type thing. If, if well, we, we grow, we use a little grow. help everywhere, I think. Once yeah. we grow, they grow with us too. So you come on unpaid, do it for a couple years. Yeah. No big deal. <laughs> yeah. Don't worry. We'll, and then as whole we team start, meets, whole team meets. Yeah. We'll get you a shirt and a, and a hat maybe. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> We'll throw you some beers. Yeah, we'll give you some beers. That's fine. Yeah, you can sit Mike's beer tower. You can even come hang out for the podcast. And wouldn't, I wouldn't count on any medical benefits. Well, of course, or like they'd that. be allowed to hang out for this, Mike. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. yeah, we're recording now. Can you leave? <laughs> Get the fuck out well, of here. That would site. be kind of weird. Just like a person, just one person sitting there watching us. Well, I didn't here. know if you just meant like they would strictly like go through and do like behind the scenes stuff, like from what we put out. You know what I mean? Like you get us Almost beers. like a fanboy. That is unpaid and does our job. Get us beers when we're empty. Yeah. Come on, smokes. Let's go. Make sure the uh, camera's on. Yeah. Yeah. (laughs) That would be huge. Oh, quick. I want to just give a quick shout out to Denny. Den, you've been uh, watching the podcast. Den thanks, boy. thanks for tuning in, Den. Yeah. Any, interest in, any interest in interning, let us know. Yeah. Yeah, if you want to work for us for free. <laughs> if you want to quit your day job and <laughs> no come big deal. do nothing. You're not, You're not busy nothing. at all with the house and dogs. and. We only work one day a week. For three weeks, and then we take a break for three weeks. So. Yeah, how much, how much does he actually listen? Uh, he said that he he came across it, and he really liked it, and it cracked him Dennis, up. I don't Dennis, know. If he really just hit, he could also just in be, his algorithm. I don't know. I, I have no idea. I mean, <laughs> maybe probably, maybe Billy, maybe, maybe Billy or our fan told bigger. him. I have no idea. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> was, That's true. That is something I never <laughs> thought about when people like I saw the podcast. It's like, what what were you googling? <laughs> yeah. Were you watching a Doctor Kenneth Osborne? Yeah, Dan, let us know. Comment, yeah. comment you guys, below, Dennis. Have you guys watched any of his videos? I don't think no. so. Is oh he... man, should I pull him up? Yeah. yeah. Are Who... we hooked up here? Oh nice. Oh, let's go. Who is uh is he he's, he's a dick doctor? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Who uh um so let's just see. I probably won't. What's his name? Oh, were you literally just typed in huge manhood? Oh well, wow, look at that. You know what's kind of funny I just thought about? When well, you typed in huge you might have some beef with us pretty soon, huh? <laughs> Signs when he has a small in, penis. When you typed in huge manhood, mean? one of the first Here things I saw was Hugh Jackman, and I just thought about Hugh Jackman almost sounds like huge jacked man. Yeah. Anyway. Do you think that's his real name? <laughs> Look at this not. thumbnail. Make it bigger with this. Last longer. What the hell that. is that thing above it? <laughs> is that its brain? Yeah, what is that? <laughs> that oh, thing That's the bladder, I think. Oh <laughs> Be very big mighty. This guy's a doctor? Yeah. Who's like... <laughs> it's got a cucumber. Well, guys, yeah. I don't want to say it, but we can't compete with this guy. <laughs> yeah. Look at that. 332,000 subscribers. Did you say his name was Kenneth, Kenneth Oz? I think it's O's. I think I said Osborne. Oh. Cucumba. Basically. <laughs> I love the way the Jamaican says cucumber. Cucumba. I think he's in Africa. Banana. Whose penis looks like an avocado? Yeah. <laughs> no, he's saying these are the foods you eat to make it bigger. Oh. Which... Nah, that's a scam. I, I know. I don't think there's anything. I've you seen do, right? zero results since I found them. <laughs> <laughs> yep, this is what we're up against. Go oh, check look out. Look at the... that. Look at that production he's got. Yeah. Go check out the comments. Who's working for him? <laughs> yeah, that's Poach's talent. Let's see yeah. some of the comments. <laughs> yeah, <laughs> seriously. <laughs> Poach. As I wait for results, am I supposed to continue using them? And depending on different kinds of bodies, could you please estimate the time it may take to see the results? This thanks if this is not scum. I want to try it out. Can we can we leave a please? Comment? Does the ingredients involve the pear nut or the food? What the fuck is that person talking about? That makes no sense. I believe what you said. That's pure truth. Was this a religion? <laughs> Should we use only ground nuts or 
or milk only or all together. Can any of these people fucking Hello, talk? Mr. Kenneth. Thank you for your help and may God bless you and continue to empower you. My penis is huge. Nice. Can we, can, it says that? Let's no, leave a comment. Joking. I just, I don't know. It's, yeah, it'd be like, uh, can I practice this, this in the safety is, of my home? How about this is You should be like, I posted this science. same video five years ago. What do you think you're doing? This is what? I spelled that wrong. Pseudoscience. There we go. E in front of the U. Subscribe to our podcast. Guaranteed two inches in a <laughs> Month, a month. Comment. There we go. Nice, we're in. <laughs> you know what's a scam? The saying "I before E except after C." Or when sounding like A is a neighbor away. Why Wait, is what? that a scam? Or what? Because for, I before E except, except after, after C. C. Or as a, or when sounded like A as a neighbor or way. Oh, that's no, the extra part neighbor. of it. Well, like the first word that comes to mind, <laughs> I before E except after C, is like science, but science is. S C I E N C E. I before E. Except that's... after C. Or when oh, sounded like or, or when sounded like A as in nay or or way. Nay doesn't have a C in it. Oh yeah. This is dumb, dude. Science. This is all right, so this is also like this is why reading's hard, dude. It's, I'm just gonna leave it there. That's why reading's hard. This is why you listen to things. Because then you're running so and you're stupid. like, what does that word mean? And you look up the word, you're like, I still don't get it. Wait, I thought I before E except after C. And then you're just lost. You're not yeah, running Yeah, remember anymore. the food pyramid when they were just like, to get health, you need to eat a bunch of cereal. Yeah. Yeah. <laughs> you just lots of cereal. Wasn't it like, didn't, remember it, when the didn't food, the food remember, pyramid end up being like upside down or something? Like That's what I think that, yeah. Like it was totally wrong or something like that? I don't know. Well, remember no, when the food, pyra- remember top, when the food pyramid in 1940 said you should smoke cigs? That was sweet. No, I was. You see, they just released a new one. Neither, but that was uh, they released a new one, and it like had like a list of like foods and like how good it was for you. And Lucky Charms was above steak. Yeah, was better for you. Yeah, better for you than steak. What's it, look at the nutritional value of uh, Lucky Charms. Yeah. <laughs> You'll never get my Lucky Charms. I, I mean, <laughs> I. Dude, shit just this is just like the cycle of like the world. Like shit is healthy until in twenty years someone proves it's not healthy and then it just goes in a circle and then something else is back to healthy. Like Yeah. I've seen so I can't even tell you how many things I've seen about coffee. Coffee is either like coffee is good for you, it does this, that, the other, or like coffee's really bad, it can lead to heart disease. Oh, coffee is actually government funded. Uh, New government funded food. God damn it, get out of the way. It says Ooh, lucky charms good. are healthier than steak. Scroll all the way to the bottom. Let's find out the name of the person who wrote the blog, and we'll determine right then and there. Is this a chart of like? Yeah. Also, fr- I mean, frosted mini wheats versus like non-fat frozen. Yeah, why yogurt? they put so much cereal? Date. Almond M and M's are forty-three. What the fuck is a millet? What's the numbers mean? Is that a fish, Jack? <laughs> I don't know what a millet is. It's got to be a fish. It sounds like a fish. I know mullet. Egg substitute fried in vegetable oil. Well, can Ice cream canned cone pineapple with, yeah. and heavy syrup. They're even like going out of their way to make it seem not healthy, and it's better than whole milk or an egg. Ice cream cone with nuts is better than ground beef. To be encouraged, so I should just drink orange juice and eat frosted mini wheats all day, and I'll be Water, fine. Watermelon's that good for you? I thought watermelon was not that good for you in terms of like most fruits and vegetables. Yeah, I didn't think it was. This like is a scam, food. Paul. Scroll all the way to the bottom. Let's determine off the name of the author if this is bullshit or not. It's usually at the top who wrote it. Um, good Rancher? Good Ranchers. That's not a person. Sounds like a candy. Jolly Ranchers? <clears throat> good Jolly Ranchers? That's a scam. This is bullshit. All right. Also, this is the problem with the internet nowadays, and we're part of the problem. Well, not part of the problem. We're we're just doing our we're thing. We're the solution. At, at, well, we are the solution. You're right. We're becoming the solution. Bad articles are probably better nowadays than good articles because it's just about clicks and views. So, like, if you just put shit out there like that, that gets people saying, like, really, frosted mini wheats are more healthy than a, like a, a steak. Get them, dude. Get them. Fuck them. Fuck you, good ranch. You All right, Mike, what are your summer t- some of your topics? I tried to make this uh, fucking Valentine's Day episode. Yeah, but Jack's parents listen, so what do you got? Um, <laughs> oh, jeez. <laughs> Taking um, shots at mom and well, dad. Well, one thing I was, so you guys obviously know Modern Day uh, High School got shut down. Yeah. Did nope. you hear about that, Paul? But you know no, Modern Day, right? They're filming a movie. Oh, are you talking about? Did you know? Did you hear about that? Yeah, so I, I saw it today. Me too. So Modern Day High School got shut down. I don't. I guess like the funding stopped coming through, or they weren't getting the admissions they wanted because it's like a private school. 
So it shut down. But I drove past the other day and I noticed that like there have been there's cars there all the time in the parking lot and like lights on and shit. Yeah. So I was on Facebook today and you probably saw the same thing I saw. I saw Someone yeah. mentioned the same thing I just said saying like, hey, I Bunch thought modern day towns shut people. down. I thought that modern day shut down. Why are all these lights what the hell's going, going on? on What's going on? What's going it's on? Out on of, it's out of state plates. And someone said they're filming a movie there. Get ready for the movie. Stay with me here. It's the Mean Girls musical, the movie. Wow. So the movie Mean Girls, they made a musical about it. And now Tina Fey is directing a Mean Girls, the musical movie. So she's and it's be, being filmed at Modern Day. So she's going to be hanging out in Middletown? Well, who cares about her? Selfishly, we got to try to get in the background of some of those shots. Wow. I think it's inside the school, though. Yeah, but we got to try to like sneak in and get in the background get of some in of those the, shots. Get in the school. Wow. Yeah. I mean, Andrew have... Rice, Ali, Car- these names are fucking. And Mike insane. M. starring in. I saw someone also post on Facebook, like, my son's going to be in Middletown. He's going to be oh, in the movie. dancer. He's a dancer. Yes. He needs a place to stay. <laughs> yeah. Should I let him rent out a room? <laughs> yeah, we literally show you. Why would they film it there? Who cares, dude? I guess they just needed a, some kind of school Paul, set. Paul, our little town, baby. Yeah. But I was thinking if I can get in the background and do something funny, they probably... They probably need some extras. They probably won't cut they're, me. They're, they're holding, I think, uh, I think they said one of the cops is like they're holding a... Not try. You know what we should do? You know what we should do? Paul, let's dress you up like uh, an older man. Like, let's see if we can try to make you look older. I'll throw on some basketball shorts and we'll just walk in in the middle and be like, we... We were just going to shoot some hoops at the gym. We didn't know that. We need to get some like fancy, uh, like, uh, like lanyards and like things that we wear, like backstage access, or just like uh, just have a thing that just says talent. Like, oh no, I'm the talent. Yeah, or 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 agent, agent. Yeah, (laughs) and we just we just say my client a bunch, or uh, we just say where's Tina? Where's Tina? Like yeah. I've been trying to get in touch with. I've been calling. I've got her soy hours. milk latte. Yeah, yeah. exactly. Walking with like a tray of coffees. I'll let you write in. <laughs> yeah. Ooh, this might be worth trying. You ever see the two guys that they wear like uh, those bright yellow vests, and then like they carry around a ladder, and like they just like walk right into Disneyland, or like they walk right into like a backstage of a concert, and they just like do all they have is no. a yellow vest and like a ladder. What are they and called? I have no idea what they're called. Goofy ladder guys. I just see like yeah. <laughs> But like they get into like they walk into the movie theater, go watch like a movie. Dude, I don't I, even. I, I, I don't, don't even know think what, you'd have to go that. I, I I feel like we should all take a different angle. We should like, all test something. Yeah, we should all yeah, try to get in. Yeah, like someone could go. I think if you just wear jeans with a button down tucked in and come with a, a tray of four fucking Dunkin' Donuts coffees, you're getting anywhere you want. All right, but what what about what, you? Like find someone. You run into a person with a clipboard. And you're like, what's your name? You're just like, I, do you not see that the, they're getting coals, by the way? Like, excuse me. Thank you. <laughs> All like, right. What an fine. Idiot. You got like, me there. You got me there. People enough. They just, okay. they feel embarrassed. They're like, you know, Jim right. or what? Jim knows you or something. Oh, yeah, hit him with the dad. <laughs> <laughs> like, yeah, yeah, yeah. Do you know where Dan went? Is he on the second floor or the first floor? Yeah, maybe like, All right. Never. Just excuse me. Thank you. Like, really appreciate you. Here. Thank you. Where are you? Coming excuse me. Don't Tina? waste my time. That's a good. That's a good idea. You fuck it. Give me the clipboard. Actually, go take a walk. What are you doing? All right. You're fired. So anyway, yeah, we're going to be, and it's Paramount Plus too, so we have that. Once we get in, then what do we do? We just walk re- get in re- frame? Just walk re- right in front re- of the havoc? <laughs> Honestly, if we're that far, our confidence might be high Stop enough. Production. We're telling the camera guy, like, you can take a break now. I'm good. Like, you just, we infiltrate the entire I want I want to get the guy that does the... The boom? No, the, what's that called when you... Action? Clap the thing. Yeah, I think that's like, a director. Yeah. No, they no, have like, the dickhead who just. The dickhead. I thought it was a director. That's not a director. Like scene five. No, yeah. the take fifteen. The director sits in the director's chair and with yells. the big thing. Action. Yeah. 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 Well, I guess he does. Out. I guess he does yell action sometimes, if he wants. Yeah. I figure he's got to be the guy here. He's really a dickhead. Yeah. <laughs> but I don't know. That's a good idea. Yeah, infiltrate right. the High School Musical. Me girls, yeah. and that's mean girls, rich, musical. famous. No matter who you are or high up you are, you drink you drink Dunkin' Donuts coffee. And there's oh, one Starb- right in the junction. I mean, there's Starbucks right there. You might as well go with the Starbucks. Nah, fuck that, dude. I guess. Yeah, but the, the no, I don't know, dude. Right. More convincing, I think. <clears throat> Even better, bring in a. Well, I'll show up with a tray of <clears throat> Starbucks. Bring in a, do- a start dozen out. donuts, dude. No one is stopping you. <laughs> like, yeah. You're like, oh, the table, oh, like, oh, what do you got? If anything, they're peeling the box open. Like, oh, look at that, and you just give them a donut. Wait, guys, like, Mike brought go. donuts. Who the hell's Mike? <laughs> <laughs> who the hell's Mike where the hell's Mike and then they just don't see me and then I'm doing cartwheels in the back of a shot yeah. like two hours later They're like that fucking guy alright no well, we get in there we get Tina on the pod that'll be easy yeah that's the whole, yeah. That's the whole <laughs> yeah yeah 
Excuse me, guys. We're going to take a two-hour break. Man. i got to go do the pod with the fellas. Yeah. I'm worried about a guy with a clipboard. I'm not. It's not a gun. With just donuts? A clipboard. <laughs> yeah. <it's> not... <laughs> with, with donuts. <laughs> like how we're each laughing at a different thing. What is that from? That's from... Uh, that, I've seen that in movies. What? But just like if you just go to anybody, like we're saying, and like you give them an option, like not only have the donuts, be like, you can take one if you want. Like they're not going to be like, all right, but seriously, who not are you? Yeah. They're going to be <laughs> occupied with fucking powder on their fingers. So, all right. That's the I be like, all it's right. my first day. I don't all know. All right, Mike, you get the donuts, donuts. You get a ladder. I get a lanyard. Okay. Yeah. So we get them from all I, angles. One of us has to get in. Yeah, there's no doubt. Do we know what dates that they're filming? Every day. It seems like every day. I, I passed it today. Are doing it, was, it right now? Probably. I don't know. I think they're doing. Should rehearsals. we take this pot on the road right now? Yeah. <laughs> Get in the car and but, go. Uh, but what if we show in? I mean, like they've been working a little bit. Everybody's face is probably getting familiar. Yeah, we got to jump on this now. I know. Well, I mean, I'm just a service guy. I could come anytime. Yeah, but now. I, I mean, I don't know. Like, there's got to be people who. Fr- I mean, sure, there's got to be. Mo- you know, I'm sure a lot of the same people work on it every day, but I'm sure it's also not totally out of the question if someone new shows up one day and they're. You know what I mean? It's well, that's that's why my angle. You're just like, like, oh, I'm just here for the dance scene, which is probably the whole, it's a musical. I'm, so. I'm I'm here to fix the the light in the hallway or something. Or just fo- be like, well, <laughs> that's I'm why I brought my ladder. Like, I work for the school. Who are you people? Yeah, I'm and like, be like, this is my maybe, school. Excuse me, thank may, you. Maybe one of us should show up in a modern day uniform and be like, uh, what's going on here? Uh, Mike, you really look like a gym teacher. You could probably pass as a gym teacher. Yeah. All right, I'm in. <laughs> or again, I think we go like you the, guys the cast, move of, casting a gym teacher by any chance. I just show up with the basketball. Be like, I was just trying to get some shots up. Like, I, you know, what's happened here? What happened to my town? My plan B, if the lanyard doesn't work, would be like, wait, listen to me sing. That's yeah. a really good idea. <laughs> That's a good idea. Then I'll get in. Yeah, I like it. Nice. All right. So our little town. How about that? Again, movies. We're big time now. The entertainment industry. This podcast, Mean Girls, the musical. Yeah. Well, like, what else out. can you ask for? Yeah. Mm-hmm. What uh? <laughs> going to the, going to the checklist? Going to the notes, yeah. <laughs> good old notes. Um, good thing we bought that whiteboard. So I was talking to my brother the other day, and he was telling me that he has recently been wearing his Apple Watch and like tr- like trying to track his sleep and understand it more and stuff like that. And it got me, it got it, it got me starting to think about like sleep studies. And I feel like no one really is a good sleeper, especially at our age. I'm like, not. As you get older, I know I'm not. As you get older, like my dad can fall asleep in one minute. Like yeah. old people could just, or not old people, but like as you get older, I don't know if it's having kids or just like life wears on you. You can take a wink when you can get it and mm. they're just great at it. I'm terrible at sleeping. Even if I don't have my phone, I'll sit there with my eyes closed for fucking hours. Yeah. Anyway, the point of this rant is then it got me thinking of like looking up like how to sleep better, how to do this. And then it made me think, I think people telling you like how to change the way you sleep is the most fucked up thing that you can ask someone to do. Oops. Because how are you supposed to? Who told you to change the way you sleep? Well, I'm just saying, they're like, oh, if you do this, you'll get more restful sleep. If you do, it's like, I'm asleep though. Like, how am I supposed to? Yeah. Like when, if I wake up, what am I supposed to do? It's my God, fault. I'm sleeping wrong. Dude, apparently like, like, fuck you. Like, don't <laughs> tell me like, oh, well, you're doing this wrong. You should actually be doing this and you'll get 20 more minutes of REMs. It's like, yeah, but yeah, no, like, I won't. Yeah. Like, yeah. Like, you I know had a how, dream where yeah, I but, fell off a building and hit the ground and woke up. Like that sucks ass. You know how like, it's so much better to uh, breathe through your nose than your mouth. I saw something. It was like so many people sleep. Uh, they breathe through their mouths when they sleep. What am I supposed to do about right. that? It's yeah. disrespectful How to tell me to I change fix that. Like, I'm a, you're supposed, understand you're supposed that. to wear one of those uh, a sleep apnea masks or yeah. something. Apparently, That's, some people actually tape their mouths. Closed. I've heard that. That's yeah. insane. What yeah. the fuck? Yeah, but, you know, sleeping for me is impossible, dude. Fucking, it's impossible and it's disrespectful when people try to tell once you. I'm like, a sl- once I finally fall it's asleep, it's crazy. Though, it's done. I sleep all right, but not. But I can't I fall can't. asleep, dude. I can't wake up. Waking up is hard. Literally, I, I read. Can't do any of it, dude. I have to read about like Chinese uh, communist like concentration camps for like an hour, and then like I'm getting tired. Turn the lights off. Within five minutes, if I like anything pops into my brain that's like you know like one, anything, yeah, like, anything, yeah, like any like embarrassing off, off, off to the races, of yeah, it's literally like that, 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 and then I'm just up. It's like I could literally be like, like I go through the day like fucking like oh my god, I just want to go to sleep. I get into bed. That's why we drink as like, much coffee as we do, dude. I can't you know, live without it. I don't drink coffee. I know. I don't understand it. That's crazy because it keeps me up, and then I can't sleep at night. <laughs> It doesn't affect me like that though. Like if I me. don't drink coffee, it doesn't matter. Like I'll still be tired at night, and I just I just need it to wake up because, like you said, like 
I don't know. It works. So that's what you wrote down. You're pissed at people telling you to change your sleep. I can't remember why. I don't know if it was Julie or Matt or if I did research, but someone's saying like, oh, we'll do this when you sleep. And it's like, but I'm sleeping. What the fuck are you talking about? Like, how can I correct the way I sleep when I'm sleeping? Yeah. (laughs) Like, I don't know. I, you know, I get, I understand. It's like, yeah, you try to wind down. You do this, that, the other. It's like, all right. Light a candle before you go to bed. Yeah. Like. Yeah, That's read a book. Don't a don't drink water for two hours before bed. It's like, yeah, well, what if I'm thirsty? I'm just yeah. supposed to suffer so I can maybe get better sleep, says who? I don't know. Piss me off. Do, Fuck do you, sleep specialist, bitches. Do you, do you sl- pass out when you're drunk, though? Yeah, and that's another thing. I, I was fucking. <laughs> I pass out when I'm drunk, and then I hear that like you actually get the worst sleep of your life when you're drunk. And it's like, yeah, what? okay, but I'm passing out. Are you, yeah. Well, when I wake up, and I how feel can like it be shit. that bad if what we just yeah? Well, no shit, you feel like shit because we drank, but like, how can it be that bad if we just talked about how we'll sit in bed for hours at a time and not be able to fall asleep? If I drink fifteen beers, I'm out, and you can yeah. punch me in the sleep face like a baby. I won't wake yeah. up. <laughs> I can't get that anywhere else. So I think people are wrong. I think they're scared to admit the truth that you sleep like a baby when you're hammered. Do you ever take melatonin? Yeah, I yeah, but it fucks me up the next morning. Yeah, Same thing with like really, Nyquil. You know, it's uh, placebo. Melatonin? It's, yeah, like it's not real. No, it definitely works. But it's placebo. No. <laughs> no, it's not. <laughs> yes, it no, it's not. Dude. I mean, I've taken it and like it legitimately like makes like I start to get like fucked up if I don't sleep. Yeah, like I'll start to it get doesn't like, mean it's not placebo. No, it does. <laughs> it doesn't. No, it's it's actually double real, actually. Double real. Yeah, it's the opposite of placebo. No, it doesn't do anything. It's not placebo, you're wrong. Find me a study. Oh, so when you so have you think all melatonin is a like... scam? Uh, then let's start I mean, with, all right, everyone, uh, welcome to Huge Manhood. We're selling Huge Manhood melatonin gummies. Let's just fucking sell people that's gummies. Yeah, that's and just, sleep yeah we'll, we'll get the gummy bears and just take them out of the regular Yeah, we're writing an M on them for melatonin. Uh, I've actually, uh, what's pretty effective is pumpkin seeds. They help you sleep. Placebos. See, again, now I have to eat pumpkin <laughs> seed not in October after I've carved it. Like, I don't want to do that for a lie. That Save those seeds. Them. I'm going to need them in March. All right, Mike, you won. <laughs> <laughs> I, think, I think you may have read the article wrong whenever you got your information that isn't that isn't even saying that it's a placebo it's saying that it works better than the placebo every every drug trial has a placebo obviously i thought you were saying that melatonin doesn't even exist that every bit of it is just fake because melatonin can improve jet lag all right fuck you whoever jack, told you know, me that's a bitch jack you know what's funny that you do that i was thinking about and we haven't done in a long time randomly with no context me and jack will not have talked for like days sometimes longer at a time and he'll just randomly Venmo request me like a million dollars i haven't done that in a while <laughs> and it just always cracks me up because i decline but i always think like if i <laughs> like, <laughs> yeah what would happen <laughs> or you just bankrupt his would whole I just, family like, you a million? like i immediately get generations of mcdavid's are <laughs> dead <laughs> to you i have no money in the I'm, account i'm living the life i have a massive <laughs> negative balance my credit cards all get canceled my bank calls me saying your house is foreclosed like is everything stopped and i'm me. nowhere to be found and jack's <laughs> just giggling like holy shit he said yeah i'm gonna do that to someone i haven't talked that's to in a really long time that's my plan i do it a lot to people like to fuck with them and i wouldn't keep it but like if we're out like a night drinking or something like that and someone fronts the bill and they're like you're sending me 22 bucks i'll request them to see like maybe they'll just send me the money <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> well instead of like uh, like if it's like oh, i paid a hundred dollar bill there's four of us like all right like send- venmo me 25 dollars i'll be like all right paul let me venmo you 25 dollars and i'll send paul a 25 dollar venmo request <laughs> what's, uh, what's like the reason you put it's like a pizza just slice. Beer. I don't know. <laughs> I, really no, I, that's, out of all the things in life, that's like the biggest blank when I get to it. I'm like, oh, fuck. I want to write something me, funny. No, I usually, yeah. I'm pretty good. I'm just going to end up putting an emoji like everyone else. <laughs> I'm pretty good at that. Let me go and see what I've sent. Oh, shit. I have a bunch of money in my Venmo. That's lit. A million dollars. Send, Why do I have Send that? it to me. Nah, that's cool. Nah, that's questions. cool. Maybe not. Maybe I'm just wasting time on my phone, not, not finding anything funny. What the fuck? Okay. Dead air. Dead air, dead air. What are we doing? No, right no, no. Now? I was he's, looking he's to see if I Venmo. if I had any funny. <laughs> oh comments. yeah. Wow, Riv- riveting stuff. This is terrible. Yeah. I'm running through all my funny content in the like mean three girl stuff second killed, blips. Yeah. Three second blips. Uh, <laughs> I was looking at. I, I kind of want to adopt a disabled dog. Nice. Why? I don't know. I just think that they're disabled. the one with like the wheelchair back two feet. Or like I've seen one that's face is like completely sideways. It just looks adorable. I don't know. 
you uh you'd have to really renovate your house to make it a uh, dog handicapped accessible oh yeah no we couldn't have a one with a wheelchair for sure no, no way there's a, yeah, there's a ton we of just stuff. have too many floors we don't live in a ranch or anything mm. it just wouldn't work we have to live on one floor. I would just hear a crash and be like, I think that we lost the dog. <laughs> <laughs> that might be, be at the, the bottom one. of the stairs Dude, looking all big. Mia would be so jealous. Yeah. You'd well, break her heart. I don't know. I she just wouldn't feel want to like. She would want to be in a wheelchair. But she'd be like, she'd, she'd she feel like she's yeah. playing. Well, I second feel like, fiddle. I don't know. Like, you go think about like buying a new dog. Like, if you want to get a puppy. First of all, they're very expensive. Number two, then it's like, ah, oh, well, instead of buying it for like 5,000 bucks, like, let's see if there's anything adoptable. Any puppies that are adoptable, and then you're looking at those, and it's like these are cute, blah blah. And you look like, oh, this poor dog is like ten years old, and like someone just dropped it off in front. Like, Hell. why not give it a nice life? Like, you just keep going further in the process, and before you know it, it's like I want to adopt a dog that has one eye left, it's blind, oh, it has two feet. Like, that's adorable. Look at it. Um, come on, let's see what's for sale. Nah, dude, they're so expensive. Really. Well, Oh, look at him. Look at him. He's so happy. But you couldn't you couldn't uh, keep that in your house. No, I couldn't. No, I couldn't do one with a wheelchair because I don't have the house for it. But like there's dogs that are like, I probably wouldn't. What would you name it? Uh, I'd probably come with a name. Yeah. The, the Tardo? Uh, <laughs> <Come on>. <laughs> <laughs> no. <laughs> oh, God. Why can't we see any for sale? What do you type in? <laughs> Handicapped dogs for sale. Why for sale? They wouldn't sell them. <laughs> yeah. For the what would you put? I don't adoption. know. Just say like adoption. Yeah. NJ adopt dogs disabilities maybe. <clears throat> Free disability dogs for adoption. But again, that's kind of part of the sad thing of it is like, yeah, you wouldn't buy it because people don't want them. Like, this one must be retarded. <laughs> yeah, he's got a rug on his head. He looks like Rick James. <laughs> he does look like Rick James. Um, This one? Oh, what happened? I don't know. A shady website it is. you know a lot of these are scams common you know? searches that's a scam what didn't uh, should we a, get a website by the way i looked up his, i looked this, up uh, huge manhood pod and dot net is open no one types dot net dot gov <laughs> that doesn't work dot so somebody's got huge manhood.com huge man dr kenneth eyes huge go, manhood, go, go, no, go, huge go, manhood right pod and huge manhood podcast are both gone what? you can go to like go go to google type in like google domain and you can uh Damn. Liars. Go to Google Domain Poll. You can find something. But I don't know. Yeah, I just recently, I don't know. I've been, we're not actually going to do it because we're having to get married and it's expensive. Website's but. a lot of work. Mm, yeah. If you want to apply for the free Huge Manhood internship and, and run our website, we'll be happy to have <laughs> you. Get us beers. And we'll get you beers and you can get us beers. HugeManhood.us. How about dot .xyz? That's oh, not 12 funky. bucks a year. Fuck, we can't afford that. Dot com is available. Wait, dot com is available? Uh, but I feel like you have to have pod. Why? Podcast. It almost seems like it's like, hey, check out Meat Spin. You'll love it. Yeah. Um, How about you, Paul? Have you ever been on vacation and thought about going to Penn Island? Was that in your notes? No. <laughs> it's also oh, available. So it is Mike. available. Jesus. I'm stupid. Huge man hoodie pod. Hoodie pod? Hood iPod. <laughs> Huge man hood iPod. Do they still make iPods? <laughs> we'll do a collab with do Apple. Do they still make iPods? Yeah, they do. I think it's just a touch. I don't know, guys. I don't think we should pass on this opportunity. 12 bucks a year. Let's do it. I mean, that's $4 Fuck each. It. We don't want some... Uh, that's $4 each for the year. That's way less than corporate I pay for Corporate fat cat. Just sneaking, swipe, coming in, swooping it, and What if we just like, uh, go to hugemanhood.com and just like a picture of something funny, and that's all it is. And then a link to our YouTube. A picture of Mike putting a cigarette on his ass. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> his comment. His comment after was great. What did I say? You said L. Yeah. That was a huge. What was me. that? The that other was... time you guys hung out without me. That was at Nick's a few years ago. I think. Yeah. That That's when it. I got so blacked out in the shark shirt, and I was like completely <laughs> nuked out of my mind. I think it was Shanks's birthday. Yeah, it was. It was. <laughs> like, how do you know what we you're were wearing? Really messed up that day. <laughs> because I know there's a, a picture, there's a picture of, of me, of... and I looks it's bad. <laughs> yeah. It's as drunk as I've. Well, that's impossible to say, but it looks like as drunk as I've ever been. Mm. Oh well, go figure. I'm not speaking loud enough again. Fuck. <laughs> that's what we got. Dude, every that's time I see your guy's fucking chart, it looks like but you're on like you're fine. like an eight on the Richter scale, and I'm barely like a fucking <laughs> wave breaking on the shore. Andy Richter scale. Andy Richter. Is that what his name is? Andy Richter. Andy Richter is the fat guy second in command on Conan O'Brien. Oh, that yeah. guy. Yeah. <laughs> Conan's done, right? Dude, oh, yeah, are we? Is are we? I think that we're witnessing now. the very end of late night TV. 
Are we not? Yeah, we're no all, one's good. They're all getting. I used to love John Stewart Colbert. I used to love. They're all getting butt fucked by Letterman, Greg Gutfeld. Was just Letterman. Who's yeah. that? He's this Fox News guy. Fox News. Who? Fox. Greg Gutfeld. Mm-hmm. Uh, Fox has a late night show. Yeah, yeah I know that fat idiot. Crushing them in the ratings. Really. This guy. He kind of looks like. Uh, oh, see this guy. He looks like Seth. What's Look that other guy? It. Seth. Who's the other guy? Seth. That does a late Is night. Is he Seth an actor? He kind of looks like Seth Myers, but he's a little fatter. A, he's been a Fox News reporter for years. You know here. who he looks like? Actually, he looks like the fat guy Ed from uh, Shaun of the Dead. He looks like a skinnier version. Yeah. Of that, though. Imagine how good Ed as a late night host would do from Shaun of the Dead. Is this? Did they just start this or something? Uh, here we go. Forbes, two point five million viewers. Fox News. Out of the way, channels Greg Gutfeld beats every show in late night TV. I mean, Paul, did you ever used to watch Colbert and John Stewart? Not really. Like they were, I feel like they towed the line pretty perfectly. Like they, were, they weren't too left or too right. Like it was just great. It was funny. Like they were both um, pretty great. Well, was this a while ago? I don't know. It was in college, me and Jay were. <laughs> I don't okay. think it was that bad. Now it's terrible. He's got two point five. Uh, Stephen uh, Colbert's got two point one. I, that, I always thought Conan was funny though. Conan, yeah, I like Conan. That's that many you know, people listen to this. Uh, Conan kind of reminds me of uh, Chris uh, H. Who? Chris H. Hanson? No. We used to, we went to high school with him. I don't know why. Conan glasses. O'Brien. Oh yeah, yeah. They're oh, kind of ugly the same way. <laughs> okay, that, that was the way I was thinking, but <laughs> nice ball. Remember when uh, Dugan tried to kick the shit out of him at that party that you guys had for no reason? Well, whatsoever? no, he was he was fueled by ninety nine bananas. The man was on an alcoholic <laughs> rage. Oh, I he would also try to roll his own cigarette for like fifty minutes in a row. It was crazy. He, just he would also spilling. drink. He was uh, doing buglers. He Remember would drink pre workout to drink. He was an alpha dude. That's nice. Right. But back to this real quick. Imagine like you're a comic your whole life and like you get the late night TV show. Finally. And then some Fox News reporter comes in and Named just Gutfeld. crushes you in the ratings. Yeah. That's a just sick background kills him. It is a sick background. Let's, should we like get a Gutfeld clip going? I don't know. I, has he um, been, has he, what's like, has he had any hot takes or anything that people have been talking about? Does he interview anyone? This made trans activists boiling mad. Mm, yeah, it's Fox News for you. <laughs> <laughs> Gutfeld, now they're going after pickup trucks. Oh yeah, George this, Sanders this is, finally admits to being. Dude, a yeah, his his uh, his sidekick rules. His name's Tyrus. His, his name's, name's Tyler. Tyrus. He used to be a pro wrestler. Welcome back. Is it Titus? <laughs> Tyrus. T y r u s. Go to. What is this one about? And he's Monday through Friday, Paul? I don't know. I guess he probably has to be. I want to just show you Tyrus real quick. Just Google it. All right. Tyrus. I wonder if I know him. Sean Paul, a related video. Oh, my God. Uh, I recognize <laughs> that guy. <clears throat> that... that Yep. Did he wrestle under that name? I can't remember. I know him. I've seen him before. Hmm. Interesting. Yeah. <laughs> That's the so state he's, of he's, a... he's now like the he's starting to take people yeah, down. He's, he's got the, the don. Highest. Yeah, he's the don of late night. Hmm. Some Fox News dork. How many other late nights are there? There's uh, Colbert. There's Jimmy Fallon. Jimmy Fallon. Does uh, Jimmy Kimmel, Kimmel still have Kimmel. his? I think yeah. so. He has a pretty Seth, there's Seth, Seth Myers. Myers. Isn't there a chick? And Wasn't there, there like was Samantha a... B or something like that for a while? Like the chick who used to be on. I don't Colbert? know if that's really considered a late night, but. What about Trevor Noah? Is he still doing his? That's the Daily Show again. I don't think that's the same thing. But that's the worst show I've ever seen. So bad. The Daily, yeah. um, they was, shoved it down your throat so bad when he first started. Like, I was, get it. James Corden. He's not who ended either. recently. No. It's so great how the whole world, like it is great when the whole internet, no matter what side you're on, what color you are, like <coughs> all just piles on the same person for being a piece of shit. Like when Ellen got shut down for being like such a bitch. Did you hear the James Corden one a couple months ago? How like he like left a review at like a restaurant and like 
burn it down and they fire back like he came in and disrespected me called me an idiot made me bring out his food for like they fucking roasted him yeah and then everyone piled on like he did that to me too yeah he's banned from our restaurant from now on like yeah. people crushed him it was great fuck that guy you guys know uh tim dylan mm-hmm. yeah there was this hilarious bit on his podcast it was so funny but uh Lori lightfoot she's you probably heard that name before i think so she's the mayor of chicago and like crazy left wing um oh yeah she looks re- she looks yeah, like, oh yeah she kind of yep. looks like a bug yeah, she looks yeah. crazy she looks like yeah yeah, okay. yeah, yeah that's her name more like okay yeah, yeah. but gotcha. um they somehow found a review she left to a live like a limousine company <clears throat> she wrote like a really <clears throat> bad review and the limousine company commented back like with receipts that she was completely lying about everything really Nothing yeah. better than that. <laughs> yeah. Nothing. Be- it's but great being when the like, mayor of Chicago. It's great when the little guy wins on shit like that, where people are just like being fucking at like that. That's just fucked. Mm-hmm. But that's great. Fuck that lady. Keep Everyone hates that lady too. It's universally like. Can you pull up a picture of her? Sure. She's like got her hair oh, looks like it's can, falling out. She looks can terrible. We, uh, can we watch that video that what's the mayor of New York and he pull he keeps pulling guns and drugs? <laughs> and drugs oh my God. And- Did we talk about that on this show? No, we told we were at your house for uh, there. She she is ridiculous looking, dude. Look, yeah. no, click on that one. Yeah, go the, back. In the blue. No, go back. Go back. In the blue. Uh, no, yeah. in the black. The one underneath it. She's like holding something up. Is that Game Boy? No, oh, it's, it's one of those no little notepads. Yeah, look gosh, at dude. She looks oh my like, god, she looks like like a dolphin. I don't know. She, she kind of does look like a dolphin, dude. <laughs> <laughs> See if I can find her limousine review. Oh, there it is. Yelp for real. Oh, God, let's go. Click wow. it. Wow. She, she had her glass of wine out for this one. <laughs> when did she write this? 2017? So she wasn't elected yet, I'm assuming. <clears throat> Who wants to read it? Paul? I would never use VIP limo again. Driver Carlos showed up early for our pickup and a good sign, right? Turned out not to be so. Carlos showed up and wants to use our bathroom. A little strange, but fine. Turns <laughs> out he pisses in her toilet and does not have the courtesy to put down the toilet seat. Oh, this is great. <laughs> Beginning of the end, we were going to the United Center. Carlos clearly has no idea who to get there. Nice job, He's yeah. totally reliant on a whacked GPS system that has him driving his huge car. Cadillac Escalade stretched down extremely narrow neighborhood streets going in a route that made no sense. I had to take over and give him clear directions to get to the expressway. Apparently that was totally emasculating to him, but how, but how says my GPS says I could get off at division off the expressway when we are going much further South and West, we finally get there and he says he needs two numbers and to return the pickup. All right. Uh, so we'll just give I'm him totally confused and question this. Carlos explains to this dumb female that he needs a number from a guy <laughs> because girls girls take too many pictures and run down the battery on their phone. The girls ex- and me, by the way. My expression must have said something because he has he then said, Trust me. I have been doing this twenty years. I'm a middle aged woman, not some dumb kid from his misogynistic worldview. I of course gave it to him and his response was too rudely close. To rudely close the window divider while I was still talking. This guy was a complete a-hole. Stupid, terrible driver and complete jerk on top of it. Cannot believe he is employed and I would never use this service again while he is. Let's see if I she can She doesn't know the difference between who and how. Damn, Carlos got fucking crushed there, dude. All because he took a piss inside. All right, here we go. Here we go. I got the, I got the response. Nice. I love that meme of the dog. Doge? Yeah, Doge. Remember Dogecoin? Dude, I made like $1,000 off Dogecoin. Yeah, that was pretty sick. All right, respond from the business owner. One, our driver did not use your bathroom. We checked the vehicle cameras and he did not enter what your home. What an insane lie. Let's yeah. just start real quick. Yeah. Imagine like formulating a lie like he came in and not only did he use the bathroom, he pissed all over everything. It's and like, didn't put the seat down. It's probably her husband. You had lots of guests over and of them could have done what you claim our wonderful driver did. Our drivers. Why did have, they mute Carlo? We know it's going. <laughs> <laughs> Our drivers have GPS systems that work with current events and traffic. Chicago often has festivals, and we have to work our way around them. It is not your place to tell him how to do his job. Three. Our drivers ask for a gentleman's phone number, actually, because they don't ever want to seem inappropriate asking for a lady's phone number. Kind of weird. And you should appreciate that. Wait, no, that makes perfect sense. Yeah, it makes sense. And you should appreciate that Carlos took the time to, to ask, ask for a backup, for a backup phone and number. In case you lose signal battery again, our drivers know what they are doing. 
All right, I don't want to keep going. I can read it if you want. Yeah, you want to It seems to me the only person here who is sexist, my dear. <laughs> oh, that's awesome, is you. I don't know where you come to your conclusion that you are emasculating him. Maybe you hoped you were. Your language is horrendous and lewd. Just your rant here make me feel embarrassed for you. Also, wow, that's pretty insulting that you refer to women who like to take a lot of pictures at their events as dumb female. This is awesome. Yeah. Imagine, real quick, imagine whoever was going against her as a mayoral candidate was like we have uh, a special guest here <laughs> yeah. carlos can you come on up here <laughs> yeah imagine like this was their dirt like yeah. this was used in the election your driver arrived early got you on time and safely to your event your credit card you provided on the contact on the contract was declined <laughs> we even let you use a different card for payment which is against our rules and you received an upgraded vehicle twice the price of what you paid for without any upcharges a free upgrade from our company they're, these both people are either like fuming as they're typing or <laughs> have no idea how to speak which yeah. is awesome and I agree with them. Uh, wish wish I could review customers like you. Find something better to do with your time. And you should appreciate great service when you receive it. Wow. Marish Mic drop. And Got she her. fucking won that. Wow. Wow. That's uh, pretty funny, Paul. I'm glad yeah, that. That's crazy. That's there crazy. Is. What a bitch. That is crazy. Oh, my God. Oh. <laughs> that's Dude, crazy. I've caught. I've, that oh. looks like a fish up caught with the hook in its mouth. Oh, that's why there's a mess jobs. <laughs> oh, the, there is a hook in her mouth. <laughs> look, look at her eyes. That's a spinner right there. That's actually a lure in her mouth, Jack. You know that yeah. one. It's a treble hook and it's attacked to her left. That is crazy. Why are I don't eyes know what like kind that? of fish that is, though, but. It looks like a, a, a largemouth bass. Yeah. Largemouth large lightfoot. Yeah. <laughs> Ow. That's awesome. Oh, man. Yeah. Damn, what a bitch. Fuck her. But apparently she's pretty universally hated as a mayor, so she probably won't last a second term. Hopefully she doesn't Plus, Chicago is an absolute disaster in the bad parts. God bless it. Yeah, Mike. I'm yeah. going there soon. <laughs> Shit. Yeah, t- yeah, you have to give her a review. I'm just going to check out the bean and just curse off Lightfoot and everywhere. The, I can what, what's that mean? The bean? Find Carlos for Type us. in Paul the Chicago bean. You know the bean. <laughs> Come on. Chicago bean. Boom. There it is. The bean. What's the point of that? Just up. Uh, it's, uh, it's a statue to pay homage to Carlos. Yeah. I'm going to take a knee in front of it. The Bean Cloud Gate in Chicago. You know the Bean, dude. It's like just a famous yeah, fucking thing. Yeah, I want to know why it's... What's the point of it? What's the point of anything, dude? What does a Bean mean? <laughs> the Bean's reflective surface was inspired by liquid mercury. How about it was inspired by anything that shiny? Do me a favor and give it a good flick. I might like it, dude. Can't stop thinking about those beans. Yeah. Oh man. R.I.P. Wow. Yeah, I forgot that guy died. Should I <laughs> give him give him some limelight real quick, Paul? Just type in "can't stop thinking about those beans" and we'll have a moment of silence for uh, him. Remember, we could not stop talking about bush beans for like a month. We all we talked about in Nashville was beans. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I want to. Uh, that bar that we went to, Paul, the really nice uh, barbecue place with the ping pong tables. That, that place, place, that was, place was so awesome. Martin's yeah. Barbecue in Nashville. Yeah. Monty's or something. Martin's. Martin's. I have like a, I forget what I bought from there. I have. And then Paul, go to the images, please. While we talk about also beans, that, we can also that uh, give our man's and there he is. There he is. Look at my picture. These are Bob, Bill Foster. Rest in peace. He died two years ago. <laughs> I think about this. <laughs> All right, I should that's probably... like the horniest thing that someone his age can say about like not something sexual. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> Fucking can't stop thinking about those beans. Capitalize he... the B too, like it's the word of the Lord. <laughs> yeah. I bet he never would have thought there was gonna be a May May battle. All right, so uh, I have to tell the story real quick. So, yeah. Uh, so explain, because I don't really remember why you guys brought that up. And They came to visit me in Nashville when I lived there. And what started that? The bean, I think- Oh, we went to that place. We went to Martin's, and we loved the beans. And then we kept saying. No, I think we just pulled this meme up, like on the way there no we were we were making that's when i created the we thought that we were going to get famous by making a fake meme oh yeah account. go follow our meme account made me daddy on instagram yeah, let's get that back up yeah and remember there was the one that was no like you guys need certified. to certify you yeah. guys need to get on the instagram with me so then we can make it a meme account <laughs> remember that mean that was like this is like the before and after faces of everyone after they found out they were forklift certified yeah it's just uh them with, with him without a hard hat on yeah but like the smiling remember yeah. that meme running around it was a template of like Oh, this uh, photographer went up to all these people and told them they were beautiful and took like a before picture and then like told them they were beautiful in an after picture. And it was just like them looking at the camera and them like with like a really like gracious smile on. And obviously the memes that came after were like, yeah, like this is before and after all these people got forklift certified. And it was just them standing there and then them smiling with a hard hat on. Yeah. 
But basically, so after that trip and we kept saying, can't stop thinking about those beans. Uh, we had our secret Santa at your house. Yep, that was the first one. And then somebody got Mike a can of Bush's beans. Yep, and then I puked the neighbor on the way home. <laughs> well, what a way to fucking just <laughs> step on the whole story. Sorry. <laughs> that Sorry, was bad. I'm going to censor that. But um, uh, me, Mike, and his brother get into the Uber driver's car. And your brother somehow knows this guy or he's related to one of his friends. So they're in the front seat hitting it off. Mike's wasted in the back. And you keep going into the front and showing him your canopy. <laughs> was that really? Yeah. I don't remember that at all. The Uber driver or Matt? <laughs> the Uber driver. You did, like, I think you just randomly did. You randomly just went, went beans. <laughs> <laughs> and, dude, uh, and he would like ask you so you would like ask you a question you just go beans <laughs> holy shit damn i don't remember doing yeah. that i wonder what those beans are <laughs> we're dude we're literally like less you know, than three minutes from home <laughs> we were on west front street like yeah. cla- like about to get to the soccer field yeah. mike just pukes in his back seat <laughs> oh my god <laughs> And so I guy just know. went inside and like Matt and Paul had to clean it up. No, I, I got out of the car and uh, ran onto your porch laughing hysterically. <laughs> <laughs> had to catch yourself for a second. Yeah. And then hit the Uber driver and Matt cleaned it up. And then I just remember uh, <laughs> them finishing up. And the guy just goes, hey, Matt, Merry Christmas. <laughs> no way, really? Yeah. Damn. You don't remember going beans? Not really. Beans. I remember because I remember another thing that I, another <laughs> gift that I got from that secret Santa was Laura got me a South Park shirt and I threw up all over. I just threw it out right away. It was just, it was, just it was tough, man. Uh, Drinking, you know, it's tough. It's, it's battle. I love it. It's the greatest fight funny. I fight every single week except for January. Jesus, you said joking. that like a vet. I, yeah. I am a vet. <laughs> Speaking of which, get ready to tune in to the the Beer Tower episodes coming up. Yep. It's going to be promise made on that one. Happy Valentine's Day, everybody. Happy yeah. Valentine's Day. I love you guys. Love you. Do it in the butt. All right. When I was a little boy, the kids could be so me, me, me. laughing at what was in my lunch pail. Yell about the musical fruit They'd say the more that I ate The more I'd toot, toot, toot. But I swear that they've never Made me do that Oh, there's no shame I'd sip my beans up and roll like a wind Just wishing that I'd be long And if I could take me back in time I'd sing that bearded boy that song Tears of beans It's cool.